Hey Gems, today I wanted to share a my second um, Stacking the Shells video. I think it's my second, I'm not positive, but I think it is. So that is what I'm going to share today. And right now I'm going to change the camera angle because it's not perfect. And there, that's better. Okay. Um, last week I purchased, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, five books. And this should have been done on Sunday, but... It was not done on Sunday, and this is all from last week, so I'm just going to go ahead and post it now, because I don't want to miss a week. Um, we're actually about books. So, this first one is an adult book, and it's called Mistletoe Memories, Four Generations Transform a House into a Home for Christmas. It's from the 1920s to the, let's see, I think it's just 1920s to, like, the... I don't know, but it's four generations, and, um, it starts off with, it's four different romance novels in one, but it's the same house that stays through the whole book. So they all transform this one house into a home, four generations worth of people. Um, so that's the first one, and it's a Christian-based novel, and it is for adults, but I'm really looking forward to it. I'm not really big into historical fiction, so this is going to be different and a change for me, but my mom picked it up and thought I like it, and it, it seems really good, so I'm going to try it. The next one I'm very excited about is The Elite by Kira Cass, and this is the second one in the selection series. I'm very excited. Um, I did start it already. It's, um in my October TBR, which I will do a video of, and I'm very excited to read this book, um, to finish it, because it's really good so far, and I cannot wait to go a little bit further into the series. The next one is The Book Thief by Marcus Zusak, and, um, I'm pretty sure most of you have heard of it, I'm not going to go into too much detail about it. It's being turned into a movie, so I thought I would go ahead and pick it up and try to read it, so I could be a part of the experience and watch the movie. Um, it's a very thick book, but I'm very excited. The last two are contemporary young adult novels, and the first one is called Famous Last Words by Jennifer Salvado Dutorsky. <laughs> um, it's about a girl who writes obituaries. She's in high school, but she writes obituaries for the local newspaper. And it's kind of her finding herself story. Um, and I'm very excited to read this because I'm a writer and I like to read books about other writers. Um, it's a pretty thin book, so it shouldn't be that hard to finish. The last one I've had on my wish list for a while. It's another very thin book. Um, it's by K.A. Barson. And it's called 45 Pounds More or Less. And it's kind of like, um, she's trying to lose weight for her sister's wedding, that sort of thing. And she sets a goal and she tries to meet that goal before the wedding. And I'm very excited to read this book because it just seems like it's going to be a really cute, fun read. I think it's going to be a neat, um, come out of age story and things like that. So I'm very excited for these books. I'm going to post my, um, TBR pile next. And it will be up shortly. Okay. Bye.